Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you uh, one rather easy way to implement uh, focus trees, kind of like how Germany has with the inner circle. You know how these focuses can only be completed by uh, the characters themselves? Well, that's a rather weird way uh, to make a focus, but I think I figured it out. Uh, so today I'm going to show you how I've made uh, this custom little focus here. It's only for testing. As you can see, I've also been doing some other uh, modding uh, here, but yeah. So we want this test focus to complete itself after some time. I've set it here for 14 days so that it's easier to test. Uh, and it's just going to give us 150 political power. So first, let's real quick exit to menu. I've already tested out to see if it works, and indeed it does. All right, so now that we have restarted the game, let's beef up the move, uh, the time. And as we can see, the focus is not completed. It can only be started by Yugoslavia, as it says, after having completed uh, some prerequisite focus. I haven't set a prerequisite focus, this is just going to activate all by itself, basically. So, uh, here we have the test set autofocus flag. So, the autofocus is the uh, this thing. So, if I open up over here, we can see I've just pasted in the automatic focus. I've taken the uh, Ascension of Todd uh, focus, just copied it over from Germany, and basically modified it. Um, I'm expecting you to already be sort of familiar uh, with modding in general. Like, you've made custom events, custom ideas, etc. If you haven't... Uh, the Hearts of Iron 4 uh, YouTube channel has been posting about how you can make uh, these things yourself. So uh, you can go check those out before this one. Uh, the position is whatever. The cost should be whatever you want the focus to be. I've set it here to 2 because 14 days is very easy to test. Um, goes by very quickly. So here we have available. Limits. This is just to set the focus will only happen if you have the progress flag. Uh, we'll set the focus, the progress flag a little later, but that's fine. So for now, just leave this as is. Uh, has country flag, whatever you've set your progress flag to be. Uh, set temp variable, this is just how many days will be listed on the focus as you can see here completion time 14 days and when we actually start the focus and as you can see here progress 0 out of 14 so that's basically uh, what this is going, going to do uh, custom override tooltip so this is when the focus is actually in progress as you can see right now it is in progress it says Yugoslavia is working on this focus the, uh, that's basically this Character is Yugoslavia. As we can see, it says here Yugoslavia is working on this focus. Uh, you can keep this localization key as is. Uh, flag days. This is just take the uh, progress flag that you've set and just extract the days out of it. Uh, else, if it's not being worked on, we just uh, explain here that only Yugoslavia can start this focus after some prerequisite focus has been completed. As you can see, I have not set a prerequisite here. I've explicitly cut out the prerequisite. Um, so yeah, this is you can use this uh, if you want to signal what you need to do for the focus to be able to start itself. Um, search filters. I just set it to regular old political and the completion reward, just whatever, generic, add 150 political power. Now is the actual important part. How does this work? How do I press this button right here? And that starts the focus. Well, it's very, very simple. We go into here. As you can see, I've... Uh, set here a custom little decisions thing. Uh, 
down here is some of the other stuff for my mod, but this is the stuff we really want to focus on. So, um, this uh, political action, this political decision called test set uh, autofocus flag will set the autofocused flag. So, we say allowed, always yes, visible only for Yugoslavia. We don't want anyone else to start a focus for us. We want only ourselves to be able to start it. Now, this doesn't have to be a decision. You can do this through an event, uh, through an idea like expiring. You can set this through other focuses, whatever, really. I've just decided to do it through a decision. Uh, so, whatever. So, once we select the decision, Hit an effect. This is going to actually happen, and then it's and then it uh, tells the user that it will start the automatic focus. Uh, but this doesn't do absolutely anything. The custom effect told it. Hit an uh, effect. We can see here. Add ideas. Yugoslavia test focus idea. We'll see why this is important later. But this is what we actually want. Set country flag. Uh, test focus progress. So this is going to start the progress on our test focus. Uh, this is how long the focus is going to last, 14, and the value really doesn't matter so long as it's above zero. So one, two, three, whatever, doesn't really matter. So this right here sets up a flag that's going to basically be our counter for how many days have passed, and it's going to give us this idea. Now, what does this idea give us? As you can see here, hidden ideas. We're going to get this idea, which is going to cancel if we don't have the flag or the focus progress. So if this focus progress has expired after these 14 days are up, the, uh, the idea will expire. And once the idea expires, uh, if we have the focus shine active, which, as we can see here, custom decisions, activate shine on focus, yug test focus. That is our focus right here. We have the shine active. Through the decision, we have activated the shine. So, uh, if uh, yug test focus has a shine on it, which it does, it will just complete that focus, and it will give us uh, a message that says that Yugoslavia has completed the focus. And that's it. So, basically, this here is setting up the focus. This is, like, all of this stuff is just cosmetic. <laughs> basically, um, cost and almost all of the av availability is just cosmetic. We never want this focus to be available. And that's why it says always no, always no. Uh, the focus will never be available to the actual person playing the game to start it. Uh, again, we start this focus through something else. I've decided to make it start with a decision. So all of this stuff is just cosmetics. Um, yeah, after we've done that, we want our decision here. We want it to activate the shine. We want it to set our ticking timer for the progress. We want it to last however long the focus should last. And we want it to add an idea that's basically just going to check uh, if we are, if we have finished progressing through the focus. And as we can see here, the idea is very simple. It doesn't do absolutely anything. Um, it will cancel itself if we've finished progressing. So if the progress flag has expired, and once it's removed, if the effect is uh, has a shine, which it does, we have started it, and the progress is counting on it, uh, it will just complete the focus, and it will tell us the focus has been completed by Yugoslavia. So if we go over here and... Uh, yeah, 1 out of 14, if we just play this out. Uh, 
as we can see, the focus has completed itself all on its own. We get Yug test focus has been completed by Yugoslavia. Very nice. Then it tells us that our idea uh, has been cancelled because the re prerequisites are no longer fulfilled. Uh, this is basically just a generic name given to this hidden idea once it's removed.